Come on. Leave. All right, Mark, I got you. Don't worry about it, man. Here. Ready? Oh, it's got a smash egg. Hey yeah, hey yeah, hey yeah. Come on. Holy fuck! Oh this shit! Happened. The fences are on. Wait, why, why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Oh, oh fuck! What the? Get to the gate! Oh hell no! Wait, why did the fences get back on? Jesus! We had an agreement. Now you're fucked. Oh, who the fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? With a fence on that gate, it's our only way out. I got uh oh. You now. I see oh shit. Are those two? Uh. All right. You oh, we're gonna use track notch covering. Okay. Oh yeah, I think I remember this. There's a thing. Chalk out. Uh. -oh. Did you really think you'd fuck with Wait, us? What's this? No fuel. Ignition. Of course. Okay, or maybe not. Plow. Lever. Ooh. Come on. If we can reach the gate, we can get through this fence and back to the house. Ah. All right, let's, let's go, Marky. Uh, slow motion. Okay. Oh snap. Look at this. Look at Lee. Oh no, there's a zombie there. Look at Lee. Lee's being cocky. What happened? Oh, shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. I'm gonna have to move it. Man. Grab his ass. Grab his ass. Arrangement? What are they talking about? Why did we do? Why did we do? Oh shoot. Another one. Another one? How many of those did things really did we push down? Like three? Okay. Oh, he's alive. Okay. Uh, hiya! Hiya! Curb stomp! Curb fucking stomp his bitch ass. Oh. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. oh, ew. Oh, sick. Throw that. Throw that out. You okay? Yeah. Barely. Yeah. Come on. Right, okay. Oh, hey, look at him. <laughs> hey, buddy. Calm down. Oh, oh, no, no. No, no, get back, get back. Okay. <laughs> Lee, you didn't have any legs and he took you down. Okay, that was my fault. I was stupid. Alright. Another one? How All many right. of those things did we push down? <laughs> my bad, guys. Alright, sorry Lee. Oh, yeah, he's alive. So we're gonna. Oh, hiya. Hiya, yeet. And, oh. Ugh. Mache, mache, mache. Dude, you should have just thrown him, like, into the fence or something. Alright, let's go. Come on. The gate's right there. Can't catch me, Zombo. Oh wait, no, no, no fuck that. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, that's right. Good aim, guys. Let's get out of here. Go, 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 go. Shit. Wait. Why did they leave the gate open? And also, how are they supposed? How are they supposed to know people like come in? Jeez Louise. Lee, what's wrong? Uh, 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 it was a goddamn ambush out there. Holy shit, are, are you okay? The bandits here? On our property? Oh my lord, what happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards Michael in the Plier. woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be alright once it's out, but god damn it hurts. Oh, poor hey, Marky Poo. Mark! Oh my God! What happened? He Damn, did y'all? Y'all just got here? Are you here? gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. You guys in just... here, fucking the bandits? Oh no, honey, come on. <laughs> Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Like, no, he ain't here. What kind of shit is this? Oh we shit! Ran into some people Here's on the Larry. Here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhands. 
We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You knew about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. Mm hmm. So much for your deal. Those shitheads broke the agreement. Look, I'm sorry, Lee. Uh -huh. If I had any inkling they were going to give you guys trouble, well, we would have gone out there with you. Listen, we may you have jerk. had agreement with kidding. those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't All right, no let's go. We're let's go ahead. Those sons Kill of bitches right now. Get away let's go. With this. You know where these assholes are? Let's They're go. hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. Huh. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Oh, cool your jets Ooh, there, there Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yes, that's disgusting. That's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. All right. All right. That's smart. Hey, so no kids, one like tries to Look run. what Lee got working for you. <gasps> Coco. I, I love swings, just like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. Thanks, Lee. You're the best. Oh, yeah. Clum Clum. Anything for you, Clum Clum. Nah, Duck. The swing is not for you. Go over there and play with the mud or something. <laughs> Alright. Um. Yeah, yeah. Alright. What do we got here? Gas cans? They're storing gasoline all over the property. Okay, then. Flammable. Nice. You can definitely tell they built this thing themselves. That's pretty cool though, not gonna lie. Wait, we can use the eight? What are we gonna go over here for? What's this? It's over here. A lot of stuff is over here. No, nothing. Okay. Lots hey bales. Uh, or horses? Might work as adequate cover for arrows, if that becomes a problem. If it's thick enough, I guess. I don't know, I I, I don't I'm not a. If there's not, not enough room, I haven't really any experience with I guess a barns few of us and farms. Camp out here in ships. So I don't. I don't know how thick. I'm pretty sure they could be. You know, stacking them and piling Looks them. Like a feeding be pretty thick. For the cow. Oh yeah, cow, not horse. Of course, we had horses. Having a crop like that on hand must be great. We're gonna Fresh need corn. to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. Mm-hmm. Oh, what is this? Oh, oh, hell no. I'm talking to this guy. Oh, yeah, okay, cool. We don't have to talk to him. Nice. Okay, I can't get in onto the gazebo patio thing. Lee, oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Oh, Do thank you. Think Mark will be okay. Wish I hell knew. no. I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's yeah, he'll be too fine. Bad? Arrow he'll be fine. I've seen yeah, guys shoulder. go through worse. How could you all bring us <laughs> to this place? Oh shit, calm down. How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. Surprise your old ass was able to walk all the way over here. If we just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. I take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything. But gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid, if you ask me. Huh. Okay. Hey, thanks for backing me up this morning at the motel. I know I came down on you guys pretty hard, but you do agree with the way I'm running things, right? Okay, what now? You're a good leader, Lovick. Kenny's too emotional, but his intentions are in the right place. Still, it'd be best for all of us if you two could try to work together once in a while. Hey. Yeah, calm down. Hey, uh, can I talk to you in private for a second? Okay. Oh, shit. Hey, your dad's a piece of shit. <laughs> it's been three months. I'm just kidding. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. 
That's just how he is. What? Does he treat you like that too? Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes, I know that. But he's not a bad guy. He just... he's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much, and lost... pretty much everything. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. And I love him. Alright, Lily. Good point. Think kind of arrangement with them was a good idea? A little late to be asking that now, don't you think? Dad's All right, late. Larry. Let's just wait for dinner, and then if Mark is feeling up to it, we leave. I don't want to push our luck here. Now, now, let's not be hasty. Oh. I'm gonna go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, and we don't need you poking your nose where it don't belong and getting us thrown out in our Nose? Asses. See your nose? Your big ass nose? Don't even at me, bro. Alright. <laughs> I'm just kidding. What's over there? Nothing. Alright, let's use the gate. Alright, there's nothing really to do here. We expected all... Inspected all that and this. Where's Kenny at? No idea. We should talk to him. No, there's the, the people. Uh, oh. What the hell's going on here? Why is Clementine not having a turn? I just stand in front of. Damn, there's an invisible wall. Alright, Clementine. Hey, Clint, do you like the swing? It's fun. Thanks for fixing it. You're welcome. Will you push me on it? Sure. Of course. Push you on this way. Mind well, asshole Clementine would say no. <laughs> All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. That's right, Kenny. Okay. Get the fuck off, Duck. Oh, that's so sweet. Um. What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, it does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? I'm not sure, Clem. I hope so. I hope so, too. I hope so. How are you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? I hope so. It'd have been a lot worse. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? Man, we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. Mm -hmm. I want mm -hmm. you to stay lucky, too. Oh. Well, since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. That's true. Don't worry. We're safe here now. As long as the bad people don't get me, too, right? I won't let what happened to Mark happen to you. Yeah. Please? I promise. All right, Clem. That's enough for now. Okay. Thanks for pushing me. Of for her course. face, she was like, it's really? Yeah. That was less than like okay, 30 seconds. Duh, Are you kidding pop me? A gasket. <laughs> Alright, let's talk to Kenny. Kenny, my boy. My, okay, Lee, what is going on here? Okay. <laughs> hey. Hey, Lee. Found anything interesting? I'm just trying to make sure this place is secure. In case we decide to make this a more long term solution. Except for those people in the woods. Seems pretty safe. Good to know. Keep your ears open for anything else that might help us. Yeah. I guess uh, Lily isn't too thrilled about being here. I could give two shits about what Lily wants. Duck and Katja need food, and I'm not about to sit around that motor inn and watch him go hungry. You're with me on this, right? Um. You're not making me pick sides, Kenny. Well, you better think about it, because that time is coming. All right. Hold it up. I hope they feed us, Lee. Soon. On the way over here, I was getting dizzy. Hands shaking, cold sweats. Thought I was gonna pass out. They've got food here. Yeah, but I'm not just talking about one meal, you know? Did Duck and Katja get here okay? No, it wasn't easy. Duck didn't look so good on the walk over to this place. 
What? Well, if everything works out, maybe he and Contra can have an easier life here. I, like I hope it. you're right. Doug oh, and Clementine deserve a better life than starving to death at some Sick. crappy motel. I'm gonna go have a look around. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit camp. It'd be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about the St. John's and their relationship with those bandits or whatever. Right. I'll right. See what I can find out. All right, loser. All right. All right, guys. Uh, next time we'll be back. We're gonna go ahead and talk to these guys and uh, see what's up, fellas. Um, How you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. Uh huh. Oh shit! You oh, shit. Yeah. Beast, buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell Dude, yeah. that guy looks dangerous. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't yeah. know. Yeah. You think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save big lots. box. Yeah. Save Maybe lots. Nutty as all big hell. lots? Get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Uh. We'll go in a few minutes. Just need to check minutes. on a few things before we head out. All right, guys. That's understandable. Talk things over with your group. Just come find us when you're ready. Yeah, I'll yeah. Do that. Next time, I'm gonna end it here. Next time, we'll uh, go ahead and talk to them and scope out that bandit camp. I'll see you on the next video. Bye.